I don't want to go on a date. I don't want to, I'm not looking for a date. I'm not like, that wasn't what my last post was about. <laughs> uh, see, I have my hands, my hands are full. Like, I'm not looking for a date. Okay, put that down. You have to be, be careful with that. You don't need that, really. Um, just, so just to clarify, I'm not looking for a date. I shared the post about why the second date never happened because I don't know. I just randomly thought about it and I thought, you know, it's kind of crazy. Some of the dates that I have been on in the past, my hands are full right now. I am a single mom. My kids are my main focus. There's a lot going on in my life right now and I'm not looking to date. Now, if the perfect man just like fell in my lap right now or the perfect relationship just came along and just happened, would I be like, eh, no, I mean, no, of course not. I would, I would love that. But am I actively seeking that out and searching for it? No, I've wasted a lot of time on that. I've spent a lot of time before <laughs> maybe eight or nine years ago, just, you know, oh, I'm lonely and I just need to go out and see if I can find someone or talk to this person or give that person a chance, even though they've already shown red flags. I've been there. I've done that. I'm not doing that again. Like, I feel like if something's going to work out, it's going to work out and you don't really have to go searching for it. I mean, I guess I'm, I am in my comfort zone and I feel safe here. But it's a good safety because they're, I do have like probably PTSD, like bad things that happened in the past. What are you doing? Okay. Okay. So I, now that I've gotten away from those past relationships and issues, I feel safe now and it's a good feeling. I feel like I'm like taking care of me. I feel like I'm taking care of my kids and I'm, I am in my comfort zone. I'm okay with that. But I don't need to, like, go get on a dating app. And I don't need to go, like, be set up with someone. I don't even have time for that. I don't have a babysitter. I mean, I don't, like, I'm 24-7 toddler mode. And no one really knows what that's like unless you've done that, like, 24-7. It's exhausting. I'm not complaining. I wouldn't change anything. Well, I mean, maybe I would have, you know, a little more help. <laughs> What are you doing? Okay. Anyway, I was just wanting to share. I guess it's practically like a vlog, journal, whatever. But I just, I think it's okay to not want to look for a relationship. I think it's okay to not want to go searching for that. I think there's nothing wrong with that. I don't think that you can make those things happen. And I don't know who said it, but there's some quote that's like, whatever you chase runs from you. And I kind of believe that about a lot of things, relationships included. So I feel like if that's going to happen, it's going to happen and it'll work out. And like, I don't have to go like be on the dating scene or whatever that is. <laughs> 